New at 11, dying on the wait list. A terrible turn of events for patients waiting for treatment at Western State Hospital was revealed in federal court, and things are only getting worse. And today exposed another violation of court orders to improve wait times while a family in pain could have been helped. Como investigator John Humbert with his, was the only reporter in that courtroom today. We're all in this together. Fred Ferris has had nearly a year to mourn and reflect on losing his son, Keaton. Try not to have hate in my heart towards anybody, but it's hard. It's really hard. Keaton Ferris died last April inside the Island County Jail, malnourished and dehydrated, just 25 years old. Charged with ID theft, he was being held there until Western State Hospital had enough space to treat his mental illness. Fred Ferris said he was told that wasn't going to happen anytime soon. You know, it might be up to five months before we get a bed for him. Keaton's death is just part of why DSHS was back in federal court today, being skewered by the judge for failures to admit patients faster. Judge Marsha Peckman said of staff, I question their knowledge of the system to handle emergency situations. Attorney Emily Cooper sued the state on behalf of the mentally ill left in jail, waiting for treatment. It's not even a compliance, it's, it's getting worse. Cooper said she was stunned the rate for mandated seven-day waits for evaluations is actually right 55% of patients have to wait longer than that. It was not only surprising, it was disingenuous when the hospitals keep that data. Yeah, there was a nice sign of him with the one love statement. And that backlog makes the Keaton Ferris case all the more difficult and painful for Cooper. He was supposed to get help, but Cooper says bureaucracy got in the way. His death is the type of death that keeps lawyers awake at night. For Fred Ferris, his options are over. While helping with possible criminal investigations at Island County, he wishes for what could have been. We'd take any months we could get right now. The judge could impose new fines. The agency's progress will be evaluated again next month.